I'd like to welcome almost all of you to Quiplash. Okay, let's have a good clean fight. No quips below the belt. Time for round one. You'll get two prompts on your device. Just answer them however you want. Your responses, or quips, will be pitted against someone else's, and everyone will vote on their favorite. You get points based on the percentage of people who like your answer, and a bonus if you get more votes than your opponent. Go! Okay, here we go. The first prompt is, what is the Abraham Lincoln statue thinking while he's sitting there in the Lincoln Memorial? Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. is a good name for an erotic bakery. It's voting time. Next in line, the best way to keep a coworker from stealing your lunch. Time to vote. And next, which new marshmallow should Lucky Charm cereal introduce? Vote on your devices. That's round one. Let's take a look at the scores. Time for round two, where everything is worth two times as much as that silly round one.
take a look. First one, a really bad superhero power, submitted by Paul and Mark Cook of Sunny Surrey, UK. Okay, pick your favorite. Next up, a weird thing to find in your grandparents' bedside table. It's voting time. one if we can't afford to bury or cremate you what should we do with your body time to vote Okay, next one. A terrible name for a clown. It's voting time. That's the end of round two. Let's take a look at the scores. <laughs> Welcome to the last lash, the final round. Stakes are tripled. There's just one prompt, and you're all getting it. Our last lash prompt is... What dogs think when they see people naked? Take a look. Okay, in round three, you get to award three votes. You can give them all to one answer or spread them out.
It's over. Let's take a look at the final scores. the feeling. Let's go. This is round one. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it. This show. First up, the worst part about being seven feet tall. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Next, sometimes John Travolta wildly mispronounces names. How might he wildly mispronounce his own name? Vote on your devices. one the worst name for a mountain it's voting time Good improvement to make to Mount Rushmore. 
time to vote. Something that should never be homemade. It's voting time. Next up. If God has a sense of humor, he welcomes people to heaven by saying, blank. Vote on your devices. That's the end of round one. Let's take a look at the scores. <laughs> On to round two, where all points are doubled. Doubled, I say. Okay, it's time for some quip lashing. Starting things off, a punchline for a joke that would make children cry. Okay, pick your favorite. Okay, next one. A good name for an elderly nudist colony. It's voting time. Next in line, R2-D2's biggest complaint. Time to vote. Next up, a bad name for an Italian restaurant. Vote on your devices.
coming up next. The weirdest thing you can buy at the Vatican gift shop. It's voting time. What makes hot dogs taste so good? Vote on your devices. <laughs> Round two is no more. Let's see the damage. This is round three, the last lash. Points are tripled and everyone gets the same one single prompt this time. The last lash prompt is... Safety tip, don't eat a half hour before you blank. Okay, soak it in. Give out your votes now. That's the end. Let's see the final scoreboard. Time. I'm Schmitty, this is Quiplash, and we're on Earth. I think that about covers it. Oh, good. I'm just relieved that Mackenzie isn't playing after that stunt she pulled last week. <laughs> Let's get to it. This is round one. You score based on the percentage of players who like your answer. Plus, there are winner's bonuses at stake. Go!
Let's start the show. Our first prompt is a good stage name for a chimpanzee stripper. Okay, voting time. Pick your favorite. And next, a bad thing to say to a cop as he writes you a speeding ticket. Time to vote. Okay, next one. An item not found in Taylor Swift's purse. Vote on your devices. Next one, the perfect day off is just 12 straight hours of blank. It's voting time. Next in line, the worst thing to whisper during pillow talk, vote on your devices. And next, what do kittens dream of? Time to vote. Round one is in the books. Let's see the scores. <laughs> it's time for round two, where all point values are doubled. That's right, doubled. Take a look. Starting things off, the lesser known other way to find the Wizard of Oz, follow the blank road. Okay, pick your favorite. Next up, the best thing about being really dumb. It's voting time. And 
next is how you can tell your new all vegetable diet is working. Vote on your devices. Okay, next one. A rejected tourism slogan for Des Moines, Iowa, home of the blank. Time to vote. Coming up next, the worst breakfast, pancakes shaped like blank. It's voting time. And next is a name for a really scary swamp, Blank Swamp. Time to vote. And that's all for round two. Fire up the scoreboard. This is round three, the last lash, one final chance to catch up. Point values are tripled and everyone gets the same prompt this time. Your prompt is the worst thing that could jump out of a bachelor party cake. Everybody's in. Hand out your votes. That's all. Now for the final scores. My name is Schmitty, and I'll be your host today. We know you have many choices when it comes to games, and we're happy you chose Quiplash. 
Well, that's everybody, I guess. Have fun and keep your hands where I can see them. This is round one. You'll score points based on the percentage of people who prefer your answer. Have at it. Okay, here we go. First one, the most G-rated term for an erection. Okay, everyone, vote for your favorite. Next up, a great birthday present for your worst enemy. Vote on your devices. Next in line, the name of a canine comedy club with puppy stand-up comedians. Time to vote. Okay, next one. Little known fact, the scariest animal in the world is the blank cobra. It's voting time. And next, the secret to being a great kisser. Vote on your devices. Next one, your personal catchphrase if you are on one of those Real Housewives shows. Time to vote.
That's all for round one. Here's the scoreboard. Round two time, and to make it interesting, I'm doubling all the point values. You heard me. Start this show. First up, a thought that keeps Santa Claus awake at night. Okay, pick your favorite. Next up, invent a Christmas tradition sure to catch on. Vote on your devices. Next in line, a trick you shouldn't teach your dog. It's voting time. Okay, next one. The name of your new plumbing company. And next, a terrible thing to sign on the cast of your friend's broken leg. Coming up next, a surprising new part of the field sobriety test requires you to blank to prove you're not drunk. Time to vote. Round two is now complete. Let's see who completed it well. <laughs> and now round three, the last lash. Point values are tripled and you'll all be answering the same prompt this time. Our prompt is... Sometimes after a long day, you just need to blank.
right, we're ready. Vote with your votes now. That's it. Let's take a look at the final scores. 